Hello everybody, and welcome back to Tom Plays Pokemon Y in the last episode. We made our way to Ambert Town, however, I'm in this battle with this Inke right now because it's going to be the new member of my party. I'll start over the bubble and hope to god that it doesn't kill it. Come on, stay alive! Oh my god! Swagger! Swagger! So much angry swagger! Alright. Throw a great ball. Using a great ball on Inke. One, two, three. There we go. Inke was caught. All right, so Shot gained 160 experience points and everyone else gained experience from the XP share. There we go. Inke, the revolving Pokemon. It flashes the light emanating spots of uh, uh, fucking. It flashes the light emitting spots on its body, which drains its opponent's will to fight. It takes the opportunity to scuttle away and hide. Give a nickname to Inke? Of course. I love nicknaming my Pokemon. This one shall be known as. Uh, let's see. It's a squid. Squids enough spines are invertebrate. Uh, let's call it. I'm liking the name Silva. Sylvia. With a Y. There we go. Sylvia! Sylvia the Inke. Sylvia has been transferred to box one. Well, we'll take care of that in just a moment. Anyway, we are men of action who are on our way to go to the dig site where we will encounter fossils. Fossil Pokemon of the highest order. Perhaps I'll use one of those fossil Pokemon as my sixth party member. The reason I say sixth is because, um, because, uh, the number five spot is, or at least one of the spots is reserved for a, a Pokemon that can fly. Farfetch'd, Farfetch'd is good temporarily, but I'll, I'll need a replacement for it soon. At any rate, Let's get off our bite, our high horse here. Hi ho, silverfish. Is this where I came from? Yeah, it is. How can I skate up and down, uh, up and down stairs? Why well, skate up and down stairs? What do we got? Oh, are you going to research for fossils in Glittering Cave? You have to ride on a Rhyhorn to get there. In that case, riding a Rhyhorn is so much fun. You can even pretend you're, you're the famous Rhyhorn racer, Grace. What do you know about my mother? I like to ride Rhyhorn too. Press the A button to find your uh, a way over the clay. That's a little ditty. Uh, yeah. The Pokemon moves that come in direct physical contact with the target are called direct attacks. If you wanted to do something about them, you could try this. Armando obtained the Rocky Helmet. Basically, how it works is it's like uh, rough scales or whatever, a rough skin and iron barbs, and could be used in combination with them as well. So here we are, Route Nine, the Spikes Passage, and here we have a Rhyhorn. Margarg! Go faster! 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 Yeah! Rhyhorn, use agility! Alright, we got an item over here, so... This entire episode is just gonna be me riding a Rhyhorn. A Hippopotas! One of the most, uh, Sandstream. It's a Pokemon with the most, uh, what is it? Basically, the difference between its male form and its female form are, are insanely different. And that's not even including its shiny forms. I got buffeted by the Sandstorm. Not Jimmy buffeted like I would hope that'd be. Oh, did I say that out loud? Using a Great Ball. Tank, tank, tank. The whoop. The whoop. A the whoop. A tank. Hippopotas was caught. I am glad to have known this Hippopotas. Rest of my team case experience. Combustion grew to level 27. Joy. All right. Hippopotas, the hippo Pokemon. It entrouds itself with sand to protect itself from germs. It does not enjoy getting wet. We'll give a nickname to Hippopotas. 
Have you seen my hippo? It hides and I must seek. You mean Harry the hippo? It's a hungry, hungry hippo. But hippos aren't Harry. Alright, so let's hop off. Oh, thanks. Oh, you always get off on the left side. No, no, don't get back on it! Ah, you... Armando is not very bright. See, I wonder if you just had a Rhyhorn in your... If you just happen to have a Rhyhorn in your party at this point, if you could just do this on your own. Like, you'd just be like, you know, go Rhyhorn! And it would be able to do this. Oh, why are we walking backwards? Thank you. Hey, I got an idea. Let's just ride backwards as a Ry Rhyhorn. I don't got any... I, for a second, I thought that was a Froakie, and I'm like, you can't find those in the wild. Anyway, Sand Isle. Use its Intimidate skill to cut my attack, which is actually a blessing in disguise, because I want to actually catch this thing. Use Round, because I don't think that's enough to kill it. And I was right. Use Torment, so... Is it the move where I can't use the same move twice in a row? I don't want to test it out, because I don't want to kill it. Either way, great ball. Hagoo! Ding, ding, ding. Do a whoop. Dump. Kawump. Shibba-da-ba. Shupus was caught. Hooray, Shupus. Alright, rest of my team get experience. Quackling grew level 22. And Sandile was entered into the Pokedex. Sandile, the desert croc Pokemon. They live, they live buried in the sands of the desert. The sun warm sands prevent their body temperature from dropping. Give a give to Sandile, sure thing. What, what, I will uh, have it be the same name as my Sandile for my very first Pokemon Black run. Not like live run, but still. Candace. Oh shoot, I spelled Candace wrong. Whatever. Can dance, cause Sandile can dance. All right, let's move over here. Bust this open with our chops. Scoot over, Rhyhorn. I gotta get down. I'm getting motion sickness from riding you. I'm paralyzed in fear. That's why I needed this paralyzed heal. You see, I had planned it all along. All right, Rhyhorn, let's go. I've gotten over my fear of riding you. We shall go along merrily. Bop. Bop. Oh! Oh no, I couldn't defeat the last rock, and now a sand dial is here. It's a can dance. Quick, Jacques, hit it with your bubble attack. Weaken it ever so slightly by popping bubbles on its face. Or kill it, that works too. I was hoping the bubbles would have scared it away, but it didn't. Clarissa wants to learn rollout. I'm not gonna use Clarissa, so Clarissa does not explain it all. Oh, I never got Inky for my from my P. Oh shoot! Ah! Oh. After I'm done with this, I'll get Inky and they'll do a power training session with it. That's rather disturb. That's that's disheartening for me, to be honest. Oh, jeez, I forgot to put NK in my party. Well, it's there, and it's going to be level 14 for a while, so. Alright, found a Dusk Ball, which is good, because those are those helping caves, so I'm approaching one now. God damn. Care for a Sky Battle with a Sky Trainer? Sure. Well, well, isn't this a shame you have any flying-type Pokémon? What do you mean I don't have any flying Pokémon? I've got Quacklin! Uh, hey, buddy. I want to battle you. I do have a flying poke. I guess I'm not battling him. Because for whatever reason, he's saying I don't have a flying Pokemon. When I clearly do. Can I ask you something? What do you call my, my Farfetch'd, then, sir? If it is indeed not what you say it is to be. Is it is what it is what it is what it is? All right, that thing with the oh jeez, that thing with the with the NK is like really bugging me. Up, 
You know what? I'll just go through this and I'll grab it later. It's really easy to get lost inside this here cave. You know, whatever. Just go. Just go. What do we got? Craig's level 25, Jacques level 25. Why did I put- Oh, I put Quackland out first because- No, I don't want to restore it! Doesn't need restoring. It's not restoring Lauren. Yeah. Let's see, I think I gotta go this way. You can tell when you're about to run into a Pokemon because the area just gets incredibly flat ahead. Well, let me see if I can... No, nothing yet. Oh, here we go. Right here. This is. I'm gonna run to a Pokemon once I run through there, because no light's passing through it. Anyo. Probably a Zubat. Or a Machop. Mega Machamp! It's just got arms coming out of its entire body. It's, it's just one big muscle at that point. Use round! I'm sorry, these chips are fantastic. Munch, 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 munch. Armando threw a great ball! I can say with the greatest of ease that you were caught, Machop. If I had been wrong, that would have been hilarious. Machop was caught! Jubilations! Alright. Really? Machop, the superpower Pokemon. Its whole body is composed of muscles. Even though it is the size of a human child, it can hurl 100 grown ups. Uh, let's call him Mick. Or Mac. Little Mac. He'll be Little Mac. Mac was transferred to the PC. Godspeed, Mac, and becoming the boxing champion of the world. Oh, yeah, a hard stone. Good. It's rock type moves are boosted. No, but I say one of a fairy type Pokemon as well. I'll probably go for Sylveon in that case. Um. Uh. Uh. I didn't want to run into a Pokemon, but I got it anyway. And it's a sun! Oh god! Jacques! Make the sun go away! Uh, uh. <laughs> Thanks, Jacques. <laughs> sun goes away, no more heat, no more warmth. We're all doomed. Oh no! Zoom in over the shoulder. Zoom in over the shoulder, find another soul rock. I'll bubble it this time, because I think Solrock's got a pretty good special defense, and I want to catch it. That's the whole point of Pokemon, I gotta catch them all, is this is the catchphrase. Pap it pap pap pap. Oh, it's alive! Oh, its speed went down! Oh, it used Rock Polish, so its speed went back up twofold. One step backward, two steps forward. Nope, not hip up restores. Armando, throw that great ball! Armando shall catch you, so that way I can tell women that my passion for them burns as brightly as a soul rock. God damn it, soul rock, get in the Pokeball. Oh man, when I evolve, that's not gonna that's not gonna fly for long. You wanna use confusion on me? Ha! Uh you know what? Because I already fucked up with Inkei. And because I wanna use one of those uh one of those Pokemon one of the fossil Pokemon in my party. Inkay's out of the party. Inkay, you're gone. I already, I, you're a dark Pokemon anyway, so... It's, it's evolution, I'll just say it right here. Is that when it grows to level 30, you flip your, uh, Poke- your, uh, your, uh, your 3DS upside down, and that's how it evolves. Soul Rock, the meteorite Pokemon. It absorbs solar energy during the day. Always expressionless, it can sense what the foe is thinking. I shall name you... Sunny! Yeah, because I forgot NK, it's out of the party. Well, you had a- you actually had a shorter run than Pancham, but still. Any run my party is always a good run. Oh, there's a TM right there! 
Every time I look around, it's in my a uh, Rhyhorn. Every time I look around, it's in my face. I'll send out Combusk. You stomped me! You horrible, horrible man! For that, you shall receive two kicks. One from the left, and one from the right. Damn it! I wanted to catch him. Clarissa grew to level 14! Yeah. I found TM65 for Shadow Claw. I might teach that to, uh, what's his nuts? The chicken. At any rate, next time on Tom Plays Pokemon Y, we're going to be continuing through the Glitter Cave and hopefully finding out more about fossils. See you all next time!